my Porsche today. All right, let's get to it. Yeah. Today we're gonna be testing out one of these two products from Torque Detail. We're gonna actually wash the car first and apply this graphene burst coat that will really protect the car for a long time. The process, you have to actually wash the car, do a full decontamination of the car, which we're not gonna go crazy with. Let's get into it. Yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> The car was pretty clean heading into the winter. It just was covered in dust and stuff from just sitting in the garage over the winter. Just doing a good old hand wash to it. I wanted to do this outside to kind of show the most real world applications to it because not everybody has a garage when they detail their car. Using a chamois to dry it and then once it's nice and dry we'll put the graphene burst coat on. The directions say to spray it on one panel of the car and rub it in with one microfiber towel. Then you actually will use a separate towel to make sure you get out all the streaks on it. Doing it panel by panel is significantly easier than doing it all at one shot because it's going to dry. You can't really see in the video here, but I did spray a decent amount on, and then I rubbed it in kind of like I'm cross-hatching it, going over one side this way, and then back across, up and down. And you can kind of see this, uh, the graphene burst kind of set itself up that way, and using the one rag allows you to work it in as best as possible. And then once I'm done with this, I switch up, and I'll use a separate rag to rub it in permanently. This gets out all of the remaining streaks that would be left over in it, and it really gives it a nice shine. Stick it up here. Work it in like that. Across. They call this cross hatching, I guess. I learned it from a detailer buddy of mine. It seems to work. Mm, rub it down. First rip, it seems very, very smooth to the touch. So for a spray, that's pretty impressive. Yeah. Right, we're going to run some water down it, see what it looks like. I'm going to put just a hair water, so it's totally clean water on this and see what it does. Not too shabby. Let's look at the side that's just clean, unfinished. So you can see what's left over there afterwards. Considerable difference of time to get off of there. So this stuff is considerably more hydrophobic. I say that's an easy W. Obviously we could do a follow up video later to see how long it lasts, but that's pretty good. Let's finish the car out. What makes this really easy is because it's a spray and not a paste or anything else, it made the car really easy to apply this to. It probably took 20 minutes to do the entire thing, and that includes having my daughter help me, which she loves to do this kind of stuff. Okay. Dad, I made a little break. Okay. Yeah, I'll just watch you on the camera. Good job. All right, so Stella and I finished the car. It's really hard to show you guys outdoors like this, but this is a real world situation. This stuff worked good. The graphene burst coat from Torque Detail. I also have their ceramic spray. I'm gonna save the, uh, the ceramic spray, which says up to 12 months of protection. I'm gonna save that for the five series. So stay tuned for that video. Of course, the day after I put this stuff on, we get freezing rain. That is upstate New York. Uh, but it beat it up pretty good. So I mean, it's, it's still coming down, but the beads like that is a good sign that it runs off. So that is pretty good. Good stuff. Another rainy day. You can see all the beads here and then where the sun has hit the car, there are no water spots, which you would normally see. So no water spots there is a really good sign. And obviously as the rest of the beads run off the car and dry, we won't have any water spots. That's perfect. Awesome just from feel and what are a little hydrophobic test. This stuff worked pretty good. And maybe I'll do a follow-up video after it rains a couple times and goes through the elements to really see how well it holds up. But I definitely like the shine. Yeah, basically a 22 year old car. So it's still looking good for what it is. If you're interested in the Torque Detail Spray, either the graphene or the ceramic spray, I'll put a link to it in my bio. You guys can get access to it there. I would encourage you guys to watch the full video they have on their website about both of these products because it really goes into detail about how this stuff protects down to the molecular level. You only have to use the spray 
every couple of months. I'll probably do a follow-up video in a couple of months to just kind of see if that thing, if that's true. But first glance, first, first spray, first wipe down, it feels great to the touch and it's very hydrophobic when we put water on it. So very happy with those results. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Say bye. Bye. <laughs>